She's live, Kimberly. Mm -hmm. What would you say are the three most important priorities or tasks that women should focus on today that would advance the well-being of women and all human beings mm -hmm. in the U.S. or worldwide? Probably just if we added up, uh, you know, what affects the most women, the first one would be establishing reproductive freedom as a fundamental human right, like freedom of speech or, you know, the, the freedom to have children or to not to have children. Because that freedom is the single biggest determinant of whether you're healthy or not, whether you're educated or not, whether you can work in the world outside the home or not, and how long you live. And also, controlling reproduction is the reason women got in this jam in the first place. I mean, for 95% of human history, it was relatively equal, but the attempt to control reproduction created this structure and racism reinforced it. So I would say uh, reproductive freedom, uh, revaluing work that is making sure you do get equal pay and redefining work so we know that the work that's done in the home is also work. It's, it's productive human work. We should never call homemakers women who don't work. They work harder than anybody. Um, and uh, following your dream, you know, because you were born with unique talents nobody else has. Following your dream, that's one of the themes of our website, actually. Yep. It's not over till it's over. Remember old Yogi Berra, great feminist Yogi yeah. Berra. <laughs>